Today we're going to take a look at a Kickstarter product that is yet to be released and this is the Astro speaker from a company called Tree Labs. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Tech Yes City. This is Brian coming to you guys today with a unique review because I haven't reviewed a portable speaker yet and also I haven't reviewed a product that's yet to be released. So today we'll get two birds off in one stone. So when Tree Labs asked me if I wanted to take a look at their Bluetooth Astro speaker, I said sure as I was actually in the market for buying a portable speaker. However, today we'll take a look at what you get in the box take a look at the features of this unit then I will give you guys a listening test and I'll tell you my subjective thoughts and opinions about the Astro speaker. So as soon as you get the box it comes in recycled packaging with a charger also an auxiliary cable and the unit itself. Now the unit itself takes about two hours to charge up fully or at least in my case it did and I got about 12 hours usage out of this device which was great. However, looking at what powers this speaker, we've got two 50mm neodymium speakers there and also in the middle we've got a rectangular speaker which powers directly for bass. Also, there is no bass port there and this is surrounded in an aluminium casing. You also have around that silicon casing as well. So this thing is very durable and very sturdy, but we'll get on a little bit to that later. You've also got to the side there a aluminium ring hole there which holds the button. And then on the top there, you've got a power button, which is made of aluminium as well and has a light to let you know if it's on or off. Also, holding down the unit for two seconds, we'll turn the unit on with a noise to let you know it's turned off and vice versa to let you know that it's turned off. Now, looking at the dimensions of this unit, I managed to measure 202 millimeters by 91 millimeters tall by 41 millimeters thick. So quickly back onto the unit itself, it has a 10 watt RMS amplifier built in. Also Tree Labs have made a big point of their pure audio, which essentially in their opinion is getting rid of the DSP or the digital signal processing and giving you guys a more pure audio experience. However, all that being said, it's time to get onto a sound test where it's easy as with this unit, just pairing up your smartphone to the device and then you can play any music you want. That being said though, let's get onto the tests. So all in all, what can I say about the Astro speaker? Well, when Tree Labs sent me this unit, they wanted me to focus on the audio quality. Though in my opinion, it still lacks bass, even though the mids and treble are pretty good. Though I can't expect that out of a portable speaker since it just doesn't have a 10 inch subwoofer built on it. Though what I will say though, is what did impress me about this unit was the build quality. I thought it was phenomenal and it survived a massive drop. I'll show you guys. So it's built like a tank and all in all, I really like what they're doing with this unit in terms of the looks and the build quality. You can hang it up, you can carry it around and you can play it for 12 hours and whatnot with your friends. Though if you're expecting this to replace your 2.1 or 5.1 surround sound system, then I think you're maybe in the wrong market. Though I will say all in all, I did like this unit. I did like the utility of the unit. I thought it was great and I thought the voices came out really well. Though as for a rating, I can't really give it a rating as I don't know what the final price exactly is going to be. If you can get this unit for $120, then I can recommend it. Though at $200, I think this is where this unit would start to be getting pretty expensive, especially for a portable. So I would like to see them release this at $120, and I think at that price, it would be a massive hit. 
Though how does it sound compared to other portables? That's probably what you're wondering. When I went down to my local electronics store and quickly tested out some portables down there, I found that this competed with the Bose systems, which cost a lot more money. So it does a good job. So anyway guys, that's about it for today. If you have any questions about the Astro speaker, then please leave a comment in the comment section below. I'll put the link to the Kickstarter campaign in the description below for you guys. And if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't already, subscribe to Tech Yes City for more news, reviews, and whatever the tech stuff that's gonna be coming at you guys.